Hi guys, it's Hayden, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how I did this natural everyday glam. So if you want to see how I created this, then keep on watching. So to start off my makeup, I'm going to go in with the E45 Moisturising Lotion. Now, I've used this for a while now, it's nearly empty. But um, I've been using this for a couple of months now and I definitely can tell a difference when I'm doing my makeup. So the next thing I like to use is my Primark, um, it's only £2, it looks like the Smashbox packaging, that's why I said Smashbox, but it's not, it is um, Primark and it's really really good, I've actually used it for a while now and it's really good, surprisingly really good, so yeah. So the next thing I like to do is I like to take my e.l.f. Mineralized Infused Face Primer. Now I've used this again for a couple of weeks now, uh, a couple of months now, and it's really good, definitely tell. So I'm going to just apply two pumps to my hand. So next I will do my eyebrows, HD brows, uh, powder kit thing. Just take my, precisely my brow pencil and brush. Oh, so it gives it kind of like a fade type of thing. Not really, but I attempt. Um, and to conceal, I use the NYX Dark Circle Under Eye Concealer. Now I also use, use this concealer under my eye after foundation. But I usually use this to clear up my eyebrows. And then I go ahead and do my foundation. So today I, well, not every day, but most times I do use my MAC Studio Fix. So I'm going to be mixing these two together today. Just so I can have like a darker skin, but not too dark. The hot, I think. And then if I think it's too dark, I will put on the other one. not too dark that is perfect so i'm gonna go back in with this one this is the shade nw25 so once i have applied my foundation i will go in <coughs> for my concealer now like i said i do use my under eye so, so called concealer too but i also use two other ones so i like to take my next under eye concealer in my beauty blender and just apply this Under my eye. Put it under my nose. No. And then I will apply my collection concealer as well on top of that. Then I apply my Tarte Shape Tape Concealer. Which is really light. Just there. And then once I've done that, I will just take my eye powder and apply it all over my face. That's it. So to contour, I like to use my Hula bronzer and my MUA Sunkissed bronzer. I just want to know why one side goes really well and then the other side looks like fat. And then I will take some translucent powder and just do this. So now I've sat with this on my face for a bit, I'm just going to wipe away the powder because I. really like a snatched um, well, snatched contour and then again I'm just going to go over my pressed powder 
just because it's really white and it's not really matching my skin right now and yeah just to make it a bit darker and match my skin a bit better and uh, then I will take my elf my new elf blush palette with four different blushes And I'm going to take this one, like so. And then I'm going to apply my highlight. And for highlight, I have the Safi X highlighter palette, which is absolutely stunning. So I like to take these two shades here, as it gives me like a really nice, really nice glow. And I'll just take the Olivia Hale contour brush, which is like a dupe for these ones. But this is a lot thicker, so I decided just to use this for my highlight. So I will dip into this one and this one and highlight. Look at that. So pretty. So next I will be um, applying mascara. Now I'm not going to be wearing eyelashes because obviously it's natural. But I like to take lots of mascaras. And then I'm finally going to take my Avon Magic X Prime and Setting Spray just to set my face. Apply some lipstick. Like that. That's it, there's a new colour. And then I'll just take lip gloss and put it over the top. So that's everything for my makeup, for my everyday makeup routine. I hope you enjoyed this video. Give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. And if you want any more makeup videos, like this video and tell me in the comments. And yeah, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys. Thank you.